tonight your homework is actually a little more traditional. We're going to work with some practice problems. We're going to do it from a website called 10marks.com. It's one of my favorites. And I'm assigning it tonight because I really want you to visit this website. It is free, which, you know, is my price. It's easy to use, and it'll give you a good opportunity to review for your quiz tomorrow. It is also a good strategy if you find that you need to remediate a skill that you're missing, is to come here and do some practice problems. Here is the front page to tell you'll know you got to the right place and you'll need to log in. If you did what I asked you to do, you already have your login information in the front cover of your agenda. So let's click on login and then you get this screen. You should, like I said, have this already written on the front page of your agenda. I'm going to use an old student's login so you can see what the student page looks like. I don't think you get a lot of, get a lot of use out of what I look at. Evelyn will not mind a bit because she's awesome like that. Once you're in, you'll have your own dashboard up and that's what you're looking at here. Sometimes I will have assigned problems as a strategy for us to use in class and you'll find these here. It has a due date, which I'll probably put at the end of the year so you can come back and practice whenever you want. But to start a practice, well, obviously you're going to click start. Well, what if you come into 10 marks and there's not anything here or if what you're looking to practice isn't listed up top but well, that's simple enough you're going to come down to practice so if you want to work on equations you'll click on algebra click on basics and then it will give you some choices of what you might practice better yet it will tell you what practice you've already done what your score was so you can decide exactly what you need to work on. As you can see, Evelyn gets order of operations. She's gotten 9 out of 10 right, so that may not be a skill she needs to work on so much. But if you come down, functions, she's only scored 6 out of 8, and that's a 75%. Not bad, but it could always be better. That is the super duper quick tour of how to get into 10 marks and find a lesson and even how to find a lesson that may not be what the rest of us are working on, but on a skill you know you need to improve. Head off to the 10 Mark site. Have a good afternoon.